So I have the opportunity to, to talk to this wonderful group of women directors today. And I want to share with them where I see a few tips that I've, I've had along the way. Uh, first is you really focus on culture. And, and the way you look at the culture of, of a company is you look at its totems, what it holds up to high esteem, and its taboos, what it's against. Second thing you've got to do as a, as a director is you ask questions. So there, there are many courses you can take on, uh, and books you can read about how to be a director. Very simple, nose in, fingers out. Nose in, fingers out. Ask a lot of questions, ask probing questions, ask follow-on questions, ask why. Don't op try to operate the company because it, it, that's the line between a board member uh, and member of management. If you're not happy with how the company is being operated by management, change the management. But board don't try to lead it. And so the key thing you need to be as a board member is an astute asker of questions that help the management think about perspectives that are important to them. And third, we're in a different world today. And if we're sitting around waiting for the economy to go back just like it was, you're going to wait a very, very long time. And so uh, I believe what we need to do is, is, is a management in companies or serving on boards of companies. We need to look at the new reality, look at the growth rates that are here, look at the sustainable resources that are available to us, look at what countries are going to grow more rapidly in this period of time, which countries have aging populations which will slow them down, and how do you put that picture together to find the opportunities? Because it, with 7 billion people that need to be served, there's a lot of opportunities in the world. It's just us, up to us to find them, and I think women directors can be a great contributor to that. So.